Congratulations, you're getting to see the Olamana Gardens all in one handy dandy one man band aquaponics kit. This is the one way pump, that's a one way valve coming here to the burper, burping air through. The water then burps, comes up to the collector here, goes up in there, rotates over here, goes down into one inch pipe, goes over here. And you see it coming out into the garden. This demonstrates that you can move the water sideways. Go down and go over. Where does it do? Comes over to here. Where the water comes in. It's into this little aquarium. The aquarium has a chamber that's one half cinder. The water's filling up now. You can see the water level here. When the water gets to the top of the overflow pipe. That's right there. And that pipe you see sets the level for how high the water can go there. Now I'm going to put this back on here and when the water gets up to the high tide mark which you can see right there it's going to flush. So just a few minutes we're coming up a quarter inch to go. She's going to come to there and when she does that that little bell siphon then you're going to see is going to take off and run. When I say take off and run that's down below. Now that water is going out Look at the speed that the water's going down. Now that water's going to go down to the end of that white pipe. When it gets down to the end of this white pipe right here, it's going to let the air in. And voila, you're going to see a big burp. And voila, she broke the siphon. And that's your siphon with your overflow pipe. It's right there in the center below it. So there you go. Simple device, the bell siphon. And this demonstrates it's running. Now when it did that, it drained the cinder all the way down. When the water comes up, pushes out the air. When it goes down, it pulls in air. Now over here on this side, this is a bucket siphon. You got water filling in here. And it's coming over to here. And this is a bell siphon getting ready to run here. And when the bell siphon, when it fills up this bucket to this height, the water's going to come down, come over here, and it's going to come out here. And it's going to suck down until it gets over to here. And then the air is going to come in there and it's going to break the siphon. Similar device. Over here, we turn around the corner. We have an aquarium set up that had double tray, a top tray and a bottom tray. This top tray has holes in it. And you see the water here? It's draining down to there. Okay? Now when it drains down to there, that water will come down and she'll drain into here. And then she'll break the siphon. And when this comes here, then air will come in. And now she's on the fill-up mode. So now this water is going to fill all the way back up to here. And when it gets to the high tide mark, which is here, then the water is going to come across. And it's going to go down. And it's going to come out here. It's going to flow through until it gets to the overflow over here. And then it's going to go down here and go return back to the aquarium. And there's your aquarium down below. That's where your fishies would be. Okie dokie, that all makes sense? So what we've done here is build this system. Weighs just under 70 pounds. So we can bring it on the airplane with us. You have this aluminum stand here to hold down the weight. So you have this system here. You have a bucket siphon. You have our latest design of the air pump. This is a worm tea maker. Now you haven't seen the worm tea maker run. I'm going to come here and I'm going to switch the valve here. I'm going to open this one and I'm going to close that one. And that's going to set off the worm tea maker, and that one will bubble. There's water down below, and we have a pump, very simple pump. And we show how it's made and how it runs. And you can copy this, and it burps the water up, and then we'll put a worm casting sack in here, full of worm casting, and this will fill up to here, and then it'll automatically buff, fresh, and go down. So you end up with five gallons of worm tea in 24 hours. This is something anybody can make out of home type materials. So, to recap, you got a tea maker, you got an ebb and flow uh, bell siphon, you have an external bucket siphon that can be used also as a tea maker, and you have your an aquarium set up here. All of this in one black case, and it all goes together and goes on the airplane with us. Enjoy!